I'm excited to share a list of 40 essential travel items and 10 you're better off without. Plus, I've got some life hacks and tips that might just change your travel game. And for the shoppers, I've included all the necessary links. Having traveled to over 30 countries thanks to my job, which sends me flying two, three times a week for more than a year, I've become something of a packing guru. I've learned how to pack efficiently, save space, and ensure travel is joyful and stress-free. Trust me, some of these hacks and tips are not so obvious. So, ready to depart? Let's take off. The first thing in travel is luggage. My go-to is a carry-on backpack only. That's my mantra, and I highly recommend avoiding checked luggage. It's not just about saving on checked luggage fees, it's more about enjoying the freedom of movement and being more flexible. This way, you also avoid the wait for checked bags and eliminate the stress of lost luggage. For this, I suggest a flight-approved, spacious backpack. Look for one with plenty of pockets and packing cubes to stay organized, plus an expandable option for extra items. For essentials such as your passport, phone, and boarding pass, a waste bag is perfect to keep everything accessible. Airlines typically don't weigh waste bags at check-in. You're usually allowed one carry-on and one personal item, like a purse or a laptop bag. So you may have a backpack, a waste bag, and one more bag. A good choice could be a bag that fits a laptop plus a tablet with space for personal items like earbuds, power bank, chargers, snacks, medicine, and more. Now onto the must-haves on every journey. Passport and visas. Carry your passport without a cover to speed through border control. Make sure your visas are valid for the entire journey. Smartphone with a good camera. Check roaming tariffs for your destination. If they're high, consider a portable Wi-Fi hotspot or an international travel SIM card. Another option is buying a local SIM card at the airport upon arrival. Slim wallet. Ditch the bulky wallet filled with things you won't need. Go for a slim wallet when traveling. Here's a smart trick. Always carry your business card in your wallet. I once gave out my card at a conference. Later, an elderly lady found a wallet on the street with my card inside. She contacted me and I gave her the wallet owner's number. This led to the wallet being returned with all its money and documents intact. If you don't have a business card, just write your name and contact info on paper and place it in your wallet. Credit and debit cards. Before you travel, inform your bank to prevent security blocks on your cards. There's nothing more disheartening than a declined card abroad. Printed itinerary. After finding myself in new countries without internet and struggling to find my hotel, I've learned always to carry printed addresses and phone numbers of my accommodations. Driver's license, in case you're going to rent a car. Travel insurance offers peace of mind, invaluable when you're away from home. Local currency, so you can always grab a meal or a train ticket upon arrival, as cards aren't accepted everywhere. And don't forget a pen. It can be helpful for filling out arrival forms when asked by an immigration officer. The next section is crucial for your trip, and this is snacks. Snacks are not just food. They're your travel lifelines. Homemade sandwiches are my top pick for saving money and steering clear of less healthy airport options. I always pack high-protein, low-carb bars, ideal for post-workout or mid-flight cravings. Dried fruits and veggies, like baby carrots and a mix of nuts if you're not allergic, are great for snacking. Remember electrolytes to stay hydrated and bubble gum to ease ear pressure on flights. A quick tip, skip the chips. They're mostly air and not worth the space. Moving on to comfort. Finding the inflatable travel pillow totally changed my sleep game while on the move. In my early travel days, I overlooked them, but I quickly recognized their value during my frequent flights. Don't overpay for bulky or fancy versions. Inflatable pillows are the real deal. They're compact, easy to clean, and budget-friendly. Honestly, they've transformed my rest experience on planes, trains, and buses. It's a must-have for travelers, without a doubt. Eye mask guarantees restful sleep even under bright lights. Choose one that puts no pressure on the eyes and eyelashes. Foam earplugs. Perfect for silencing any unwanted noise, whether it's from snoring neighbors or the engine's hum. Refillable water bottle. 
stay hydrated, reduce plastic use, and save money on overpriced airport water. Opt for a durable, foldable bottle to save space in your luggage. As always, you'll find links to every item mentioned in the video in the description below. Clothing, what to wear and what to avoid. Compression socks, perfect for preventing swelling and discomfort on long flights. Cabin slippers, select foldable ones that come with a separate bag for convenience. Sunglasses, I personally adore the classic aviator style for its shape and travel vibe. Cap or hat, Pick a soft, foldable option that easily fits into your luggage. When it comes to clothing, understanding what not to pack is as important as knowing what to pack. First off, leave jewelry at home to sidestep the risk of losing it. There are plenty of stylish yet affordable alternatives out there. I even know a couple who crafted fake engagement rings just for their travels. Next, skip packing blankets. A hoodie or an extra layer works just fine for the cabin, plus airlines often provide blankets. Lastly, forget the umbrella to save space. Replace it with a lightweight raincoat or poncho instead. I wouldn't presume to dictate your wardrobe choices because so much depends on your destination, the purpose of your trip, and how long you'll be staying. Choose versatile, layerable clothing that can adjust to different situations and weather conditions. Keep in mind most places have laundry services, so you can wear items more than once. My strategy is to pack smart, which lets me travel with just one backpack, even on two week trips. The cornerstone of my packing philosophy is the I will definitely need this rule, complemented by the principle of avoid just in case items. Remember, every item in your pack is a choice between necessity and burden. Only pack items you're certain you will use. Don't overpack and avoid the just-in-case trap to keep your luggage light and easy to handle. Let's say you're debating whether to pack workout clothes. The real question is whether you truly plan to hit the gym on your trip or if it's a just-in-case thought. If you're certain you'll use them, then go ahead and pack them. Otherwise, it's best to leave them and any just-in-case items at home. This goes for hiking shoes, a dinner dress, and anything else you're contemplating. If you're unsure about packing something, leave it behind unless you're certain it will be used. Following my packing strategy not only lightens your baggage, but also makes decision-making easier while traveling. These simple rules can significantly reduce stress, save energy, and cut costs. Do you see it the same way? Let me know if you agree or if you have a different take on it. Here are more tips for saving and organizing space in your luggage. Avoid packing paper books and magazines. Although books are wonderful, they're heavy and occupy a lot of space. Instead, download digital content like as ebooks, movies, music, and offline games to stay entertained. As I mentioned before, avoid bulky filled travel pillows. It's always a hassle figuring out where to put them. Utilize Ziploc or vacuum bags to organize your belongings and compress clothes to save valuable space in your luggage. Safety essentials. First, ensure you have printed copies of important documents. Store them separately from the originals to safeguard against loss or theft. Emergency cash. It's smart to have some stashed away for unexpected situations and keep it in hidden compartments. I don't carry all my money around and avoid leaving it in easily accessible places like a backpack pocket or wallet. I'm also wary of hotel safes since staff can open them. Instead, I use a disguised pack of gum or tissues to ensure I won't stay broke. Luggage lock. Pick four or five digit combination locks rather than keys to sidestep the hassle of lost keys. I never use the high-tech fingerprint locks that come with mobile apps and also avoid locks marked as TSA approved. This label indicates that airport security personnel and potentially anyone with a TSA master key can easily unlock them in a flash. I'm not against security measures, but the potential for theft with these locks does concern me. Hygiene and toiletries. Bring along your regular cosmetics, medication, and toiletries, but keep your luggage light. Swap out large bottles for compact versions to save space. They're both airport and travel friendly face and body wipes for quick refreshes, hand sanitizer, pocket tissues, lip balm, 
face moisturizer to combat dry cabin air. Compact oral hygiene solution, a three-in-one travel kit featuring a toothbrush, toothpaste, and mouthwash. A pack of solid hygiene bars to avoid liquid restrictions and save space. I usually have solid shampoo bar, solid sunscreen, solid laundry strips. They're like detergent pods, but in solid form. Medicine, melatonin. It will help you sleep well and adjust to new time zones more easily, reducing your jet lag. Motion sickness pills. I use them in airplanes, boats, and sometimes in cars and buses. The travel pill box specifically designed for journeys simplifies medication storage. Instead of carrying bulky medicine boxes, fill this travel box with the pills you need, labeling them with stickers for quick identification. And finally, we've reached my favorite section of the checklist, electronics. Noise reducing headphones are a must have. Choose compact earbuds instead of bulky over the head headphones to conserve space. Active noise cancellation is key for minimizing surrounding noise. For those who sleep with earbuds and are concerned about them falling out, a simple life hack is to wear a headband to keep them securely in place. Power bank. Choose one that includes a wall plug and built-in cables for flexible charging possibilities. It serves as both a traditional charger and an external power bank. No matter what laptop you use, a slim Bluetooth mouse designed for travel can save space. A quiet model won't disturb anyone, making it perfect for airplane use. Travel shavers. Seek out minimalist models that are specially designed for travelers. A key travel accessory is a car phone mount, invaluable for navigation in a rental car. Also, take a compact phone charger equipped with both USB and USB-C ports. For those renting a scooter or bike, a handlebar phone holder is essential. It keeps your map route in clear view, ensuring you stay on track. And finally, travel adapters. Avoid the super universal adapters as they're bulky and only support one outlet at a time. Instead, pack small country-specific adapters to keep your devices charged efficiently and without the bulk. With all these essentials, you're not just prepared, you're set for an adventure with ease and style. I really hope you enjoyed the video and found something helpful for you. Please share this video with your friends if you find this checklist useful. For more travel insights, feel free to explore other videos on this channel. In wrapping up my extensive travel checklist, it's crucial to acknowledge that while the tangible items we pack can greatly enhance our travel experience, the intangible qualities we carry with us, curiosity, adaptability, and open mind are equally vital. Be prepared to learn from the world around you and you'll find yourself effortlessly navigating airports, exploring cities, and creating memories without the weight of the world on your shoulders. Travel is more than just visiting new places. It's about personal growth and gaining experience. Each journey helps us learn more about ourselves and the world. Embrace your adventurous spirit and stay open to new experiences. Wishing you safe, enriching, and life-changing travels ahead. Thanks for sticking with me to the end. Happy travels.